Hello guys, welcome back. Llama 3 is out and everybody is talking about Llama 3, right? So when such big models are published, what we want to do is try it locally as well as in some online platforms, right? In this video, I will show you how to run Llama 3 model with Olama as well as I will show you three different websites where you can try these big models once they are published. You can bookmark that and use that for future purposes also. Let's get started. First thing first, this is the website of Olama and I, as I said you before also, I'm going to show you how to run Olama. If you are completely new to uh, Olama, I have created a playlist of Olama before also. You can just go here and find the best video you want to watch because there are rag implementations also using Olama and so on, right? But this video is just how to get you started with Olama and I will show you how to have a simple web UI also to, to use all the models downloaded using Olama. Yeah, this is the website. Just click download icon here and you, you can download it. It will also ask you to download the CLI of Olama. That's it. Once that is done, you, you have your Olama installed. But as I said before also, if you need any guidance, just watch this video where I have shown you how to install uh, Olama, right? What we need to do is go to the models here and just source Llama 3 as you can see here. And here is Llama 3. It is already downloaded 104.7k plus updated yesterday, right? What you need to do is just copy this Olama run Llama 3. If you want to know more details about it also, you can just go here and read, okay, what it is. Here is also the link down here, or you can follow any any people who are tweeting about it or posting things, medium articles and so whatnot. And the quick brief intro is from Anne Lacoon in Twitter. As you can see here, Lama 3 is out, 8B and 70B models available today, 8K context length, trained with 15 trillion tokens on a custom built 24K GPU cluster. Great performance on various benchmarks with Lama 3 8B doing better than Lama 2 70B in some cases. More versions are coming over the next few months. Let's see what we will have. We will see in the next few months, right? Okay, now let's copy this. Go to your terminal. And first, once you download, uh, Lama, Ol Olama will be running locally in some port, right? If that is not running, what you can also do is you can run Olama solve and it will solve in the local host. If I run this, as you can see here, it is showing that it is listening on port 127001 If I copy this and if I go to, let's say the UI, I will just paste this and you can see that Olama is running. This is one way of running it. Another way can also be if you just go here, if you don't want to do the Lama solve, you can just open it like this. If you have downloaded in the Mac, you can do this and just run Olama, enter, and it will be running and it will, you will see the icon on somewhere on your on your, on your laptop or, or any machine. So this one I can just cancel because it is now shown on the top of the screen. You cannot see here in the machine, but anyway, these two things uh, work. And now what I can do is I can just paste the thing, not this one, but I can actually type, right? Olama run llama 3 that's it if i run enter it is pulling the manifest so remember that the first time it needs to pull the model this is same as how you used to use the docker if you have used before if you want to pull something docker pull the command right this is same way how it is done olama run llama 3 so it first pulls that and then runs Okay, when it is downloading, it takes some time to download. As you can see here, I will show you the websites from where you can run Llama 3 also. So yeah, here I have websites here. Hogging chat is one thing. So if you haven't, if you don't know what is hogging chat, it is same as chat GBT by hogging face. I have created the videos before also, but if you go to this icon, you can choose models from here. And you can see there is Meta Llama, Meta Llama 370B instruct. Just choose this one, activate this, close this one. And now you can see it is using the Meta Llama 3. And go here, ask any questions. This is one platform. 
second is the labs perplexity labs you can go to labs.perplexity.ai and from this drop down you can choose different models and there is here llama 3 8 b instruct and llama 370 b instruct maybe it is not showing on the screen because my recording is out of that but if i choose this one as you can see i have chosen llama 3 70 b instruct and now just go here and ask anything you want right and the next one is this chat.lmsys.org here you can have different things for example arena you can arena side by side region direct chat there is a leaderboard also and there is this direct chat from here it's by default chosen the llama 370b instruct but if you click here you can see there are different models you can just switch between different models and try for example let's say 70b just go here and just do high and yeah it will be solving here and that's it there are three different places i showed you just go here try llama 3 because it seems to be a really good model i hope now our model is being downloaded so as you can see here it is downloaded and it is 4.7 gb in size and now it is saying success and it is asking us something right send matches so if i say okay what is meta so yeah okay in general meta refers to something that goes beyond the original scope of purpose so yeah it is it does not know meta means facebook but if i say what is meta ai then it will maybe know okay another great question meta ai refers to a resource organization within meta formerly facebook so now it knows what is meta ai so you need to be precise in asking the question so yeah this is how you can run uh, llama 3 locally as well as from the websites but what if you want to have a good looking chat ui where you can run all the models of olama let me just go out here saying buy okay okay buy t but it went out anyway so let's say that i have different models olama list so there are different models how can i use this now in a chat ui right i have already created the video before if you see here there is this olama web ui you can follow that video but what you need to do is you need to have a uh, docker installed first make sure you have docker installed and running so you need to have it running also for example here i have my docker desktop already running and if you go to this github here i will show you which one it is open wave ui i will provide the link in the description also if you go down here i have actually highlighted the part here if olama is on your computer use this command so what we can do is copy this one you can go through this readme file and find all different stops uh, which you can just go here and try but here i will go and then just do control v so if i run enter again as i said before first what we did is here we did olama run llama 3 and now here we are doing docker run and this so olama and docker they are kind of similar syntax and you might be thinking why it is similar because the person who is creating uh, olama has worked before in docker so that's the way how this new concept of running the models come from so yeah now it is actually importing the thing so once this is importing or let's say pulling from from the internet what you can do is if you go to this docker desktop here it will be appearing here and we can run the chat ui that's it after that we can use the same model that i just this olama run llama 3 we can use that in chat ui so you can see here there is the open uh, wave ui and it is listening in the port uh, 3000 if i click this yeah here you can see 401 unauthorized so we need to log in first so you can create a password and log in you can sign up i think i have already created the password but i forget now so what i can do is i can sign up here okay i can give here my name sudarshan koirala email basic dot science okay at the rate gmail.com i will put some password here i will create the account okay save what's new okay get it so yeah you can see now we have a good looking ui right oh, hello so doesn't quite how can i help you today you can ask the questions but first if you need to go here and choose the models if you click here 
you can see all the different models and there is llama 3 latest we can choose this one and now you can ask the question okay show me a code snippet there you go now the same thing what i just showed you before in the terminal now you can go here and use the simple looking chat ui so yeah many of you joined recently so i just want to show okay this is how quickly you can run models from olama locally in your computer and one good thing is now once you know how to run olama uh, let's say llama 3 via olama you can just go here in the models section and there are many models here so you can just pull the models and run locally and also the websites that i showed you this hugging chat perplexity labs and this lmsys chatbot arena there are many models so you can just go here and try different models and use the one that best fits your use case that's easy that you can just go here and play around with different models find the latency how it performs how you can compare between the different models and so on so yeah that's all for this video thank you for watching and see you in the next one